Hey there guys, Misty here. Welcome back to an update video. This is going to be quick, short, and sweet because I don't feel well. <laughs> That's why I wasn't here yesterday and I'll talk about that more in just a minute. But first, let's see what I weighed in last week. So I'm at 373 pounds and holding. I've switched my weighing days to Wednesdays. Um, I don't know why. It's just been what I've been doing. So when I make these update videos, I really am talking about the prior week. So I had a rough week last week as far as stress and wanting to be an emotional eater. And I didn't. I've been struggling that with my whole entire life and it'll probably always be a struggle and I didn't have a really good therapy session yesterday. Um, Sunday was rough and I'm going to tell you what happened and maybe you guys can tell me if you've ever experienced this in the comments down below. I've been struggling with leg cramps probably since Thursday or Friday and I thought maybe it was the keto flu, maybe I just need some electrolytes. Um, but to help combat that, I've been taking Flexeril. Now, Flexeril is a muscle relaxant, <laughs> and I have myasthenia gravis, which causes muscle weakness. So, it's been a rough time <laughs> because I am re essentially relaxing muscles that are already weak. But I have to. I think it was Thursday night or Saturday. I don't remember, but Rob had gotten on the treadmill, and I, my leg cramped up so hard. It was like from my tip of my toes all the way up my thigh. And I could not move. Like I literally could not stand up. I could not walk. He was on the treadmill. I was screaming bloody murder because he had the door shut. He had his TV up real high. He was on the treadmill. And finally he heard me and he was able to get me a Flexerel. And after about an hour and a half, it finally had calmed down. Um, and then on Sunday, we went and did grocery shopping that morning, typical day. Um, got, we ate early, we ate around 11, and around 6 o'clock, I was sitting at my desk. Rob normally goes bowling on Sunday, but since it was Super Bowl Sunday, he didn't. And I had no desire to watch the damn Super Bowl. I was just like, I was just glad that the Patriots lost. If you're a Patriots fan, fan I apologize. Um, so I was sitting at my desk, and all of a sudden, I got, like, sleepy. I'm not just like, oh, I'm tired. Like, I couldn't hold my head up. I felt like my blood sugar was crashing. Um, I was just, it just hit me like a ton of bricks out of nowhere. And then I got, like, I was trying to focus on my computer because I was working. And I got double vision. And I couldn't see anything. So I stood up to go get my meter because I thought maybe my blood sugar is high. Um, I stood up and the room started spinning. And I honestly thought I was going to faint. So... I walk, I'm holding on to the wall, we have a little hallway, I'm holding on to the wall and like the ledge, and Rob's like, what's the matter? I was like, I feel like I'm going to faint. He's like, what? I was like, I feel like I'm going to faint. So I get to the table, I take my blood sugar, it's like 140, so I know it's not a blood sugar issue. So he was like, what do you want to do? I was like, I gotta go get, I'm going to go get in bed. So I got in bed, I sat up, and we have a huge headboard, so I was like leaning against the headboard. Like, keeping my eyes closed because, again, double vision. It was blurry. The room was spinning. And then all of a sudden, I got so nauseous. <laughs> I was like, oh, my God, I'm going to throw up. And Rob's like, I said, I need a bucket. And he's like, what? I was like, I need a bucket. And so he ran to get a bucket, and I ran into the bathroom. So when I got back in bed... Again, I was leaning up against the headboard because still the room was spinning. I had double vision. All of, out of the blue, out of nowhere, every muscle in my body started twitching. And I am not exaggerating. Every single muscle. My eyes, like my cheeks, um, my abdomen, my back, my, like my legs, my calves, my feet. If whatever, every single muscle started twitching. And it scared the holy shit. <laughs> I am not gonna lie. And then I felt like I was having trouble breathing. And I was like, am I in a myasthenia crisis? Because that, like, it can kill you. And luckily, we were right across the street from the hospital. But I was so scared. And then I was nauseous on top of it. I was like, what the 
hell. So I'm trying to Google symptoms to see if I need to go to the emergency room. And of course, Google says it's either um, the flu, a stomach virus, a couple of other things. And I was like, oh my word. And as time went on, I felt myself, like my breath getting more shallow. And I was like, I think I'm scaring myself and having a panic attack. So I tried to calm myself down. Um, like just take some breaths and just just lay there and just be just try to calm myself down and it took probably a good two to three hours before my body stopped twitching and I still have no idea why I did it um so I woke up yesterday like I stayed in bed until almost 10 o'clock got up took a shower went to therapy and I was gonna go get my um, car inspected because that's due this month and I texted Rob and I was like change of plans I was like I gotta go to bed so I got home at 12 30 I laid down and I was in bed until 4 30 4 45 Rob got home um I had put out some stuff that we had frozen and he ate that and I didn't eat because I was like I still don't feel well so um yeah I I woke up today at 10 o'clock <laughs> Um, part of the reasons is because it's so dark outside. We're getting winter weather today. It's been rainy. It's supposed to freeze. And I, I've just been so incredibly, like, just tired. So it's been, it's been a rough, a rough few days. But if you guys have experienced anything like that before, please let me know in the comments. Because honestly, it really did freak me out. I'm scared to death. But other than that, um... Like I said, I've been dabbling in zero carb and I basically have been living that life the past couple of weeks. But I think next week, not this week because I haven't a um, meal planned, but next week I'm going to go back to keto um, and do keto until my anniversary to see if I can lose weight a little faster. I mean, two pounds a week is good, but I would like to lose it a little bit quicker. So yeah, so that's it. Um, again, I haven't been posting my weekly meals because they've been so boring and basically Rob's eating a protein and then green beans and rice and quinoa mix and I've just been eating meat. Um, and a lot of times I don't even eat dinner, I just eat lunch. So anyway, sorry this is so fast, sorry it's a bit disjointed, but again, I don't feel well and but I wanted to make sure I got a video up for you guys. So I hope you ha are having a good week and um, if you're in Texas, be careful with this winter mix or whatever the hell is supposed to happen. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye for now.